So, my name is Atsushi Wakimoto. I'm from uh, Japan Media's Festival and uh, I take charge of the curation of Japan Media's Festival in Vienna 2009. The Japan Media Arts Festival is contest. Every year we uh, call for entries from all over the world uh, about four divisions like uh, art division, entertainment division, animation division, and manga division. Mm -hmm. And uh, every year in February in Tokyo we have the big Japan Media Festival every year. Uh -huh. In Tokyo? In Tokyo. And why did it happen in Vienna then this year? Ah, yeah. <laughs> so every year uh, we, we're supposed to have uh, exhibition of Japan Media Festival uh, once a year in one city in foreign country. Uh -huh. So uh, this year <laughs> is the uh, Japan, Japan, Japan Australia year. Yeah, yeah. let's put it there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is actually the next paper. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's all right. It's okay. It should work. This year, uh, this is for the next uh, festival in Tokyo. Yeah. No. Ah, this is already next one, 13th. Yeah, 13th. Uh -huh. So, this is for the next festival, but uh, once a year, so we have an uh, exhibition in foreign country, and uh -huh. then this year, 2009, is Japan Austria year. Uh -huh. So, we decided to have the exhibition in Vienna, ex uh, especially in, uh, in Museum Court, uh -huh. because it's the this is a uh, museum quarter is the place for the new kind of generative art, artistic uh, activities. Digital culture. Digital so culture, have, yeah. yes. So that's why we choose the place. Uh -huh. yeah. And there was already a collaboration with Coded Cultures. Yes. Uh -huh. So uh, actually, uh, first uh, we collaborated at the Coded Cultures in Vienna at this May because we uh, we had a screening program at the Coded Cultures in Vienna and then we collaborated to, to construct our exhibition in Vienna of Japan Media Festival with the, with the staff of Coded Cultures. Uh -huh. and that's an in, incredibly nice team, I think. Uh -huh. yeah. So you are actually responsible for the fame of Japanese media art in the world, that people believe that Japan is the paradise for media artists. All right. <laughs> <laughs> but is it true? Uh, actually, I think, uh, in my opinion, it's true. Yeah, mm -hmm. because that uh, uh, in Japan, uh, we doesn't have any obstacle, obstacle to the technology or digital media or mm -hmm. digital technology, because we use them how to you uh, we use them for the daily life mm -hmm. and the, on the other hand uh, we have our art, uh, artists in japan uh, especially the media artists make their uh, artworks for just just to uh, express the playfulness mm -hmm. yeah but there's for instance there's no funding or there's hardly any structures that support artists to create ah, is to it great. ah there are several kind of foundations mm -hmm. and uh, also for also us mm -hmm. it's the one of the uh, foundation to promote the new kind of creation mm -hmm. so because why we promote the media art or animation and the manga this is a new kind of new japanese culture mm -hmm. so and is there a market for media art actually ah mm. except for media arts festival <laughs> <laughs> yeah uh, in Japan also, uh, there are also many kinds of conferences and uh, uh, some kind of uh, academic activities, but uh, uh, especially for the, uh, about the market in Japan, is not so big, not so big. So that's why the media artist uh, goes, to, goes, around, uh, goes around the world mm -hmm. and they show their works. Mm -hmm. in foreign countries. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you for <laughs>